This is your World Cup update for Thursday, June 24th. I'm Trey Wittish. It's out with the old and in with the new at the World Cup as defending champion Italy were dispatched by Slovakia. Both Italy and France, its opponent in the 2006 final, have been sent home from South Africa in disgrace. Paraguay joined Slovakia in the round of 16 following a goalless draw with New Zealand. But first, a wild game in Johannesburg as Slovakia crushed Italy's dreams of a repeat with a 3-2 victory. The game was marred by dirty play in the dying moments as Italy tried in vain to tie the score. Robert Videk scored a pair for Slovakia, while Camille Kopunek's late goal proved to be the winner. Slovakia, making its first appearance since its divorce with the Czech Republic, is the surprise second-place finisher in Group F. The top spot goes to Paraguay by virtue of its scoreless tie with upstart New Zealand. The Kiwis needed a win to stay alive, but were stifled by Paraguay in a match that provided few entertaining moments. Looking at your final Group E standings, Disgrazia for Italy, which departs winless. Paraguay finishes first with five points and moves on to play the second-place finisher in Group E, likely Japan or Denmark. Slovakia's reward will probably be a round 16 date with the Netherlands, which should lock up its first place in Group later today. The Dutch will take on Cameroon at Greenpoint Stadium. There's little to play for besides pride for the Africans, who are sitting on zero points in the tournament. Meanwhile, it's do or die for Denmark and Rustenburg as the Danes take on second place Japan. Denmark needs to defeat Japan, which only needs a draw to get through. Japan and Denmark are sitting on three points apiece, but the Japanese have the advantage on goal differential. For the Netherlands, anything short of a complete catastrophe could, would send them through as group winners to play Slovakia. In other news from the World Cup, the USA is preparing for Saturday's round of 16 match with Ghana. Landon Donovan scored the biggest goal in U.S. soccer history yesterday, helping the U.S. claim its first group victory since 1930. Ghana, you may remember, knocked the U.S. out of the 2006 World Cup with a dominating performance. This has been your World Cup update for Thursday, June 24th. I'm Trey Wittish. Stay logged on to rttnews.com for continuing updates throughout the day.